What's going on, guys? It's Urban Retreat here. Andre, I know you don't want to fight your brother. But I remind you, this meeting was not my idea. It was Raymond's. I need this fight, Dre. The public has doubts about who deserves to fight for the title, me or you. You stole your brother's thunder, Andre. Man, I didn't steal anything. It's not about that. I've been Big Baby Bishop ever since you won the gold medal. I never had a chance to be anything else. Never even had a chance to be my own man. Sorry, Raymond. I, I didn't mean to... It's my brother. You owe me the chance to prove myself. Now I think they make me play freaking Raymond, and I think you have to lose or something like that. All right, let's go training. Oh, whoops! Wrong button. Hit the right stick instead of the left. Okay, I hit. I definitely hit that, but I guess not. So he's gonna fight like hell. He's got something to prove to the world, to himself. You've got to give this 100%. I'm going for it. I'm not going to blame and owe yourself any favors by taking it easy on him. Or by looking for a way out. you got to give it 100%. Oh. Uh, now, I wish they told us a stat, like attribute upgrade screen or something. Brian Kenny back here in our Friday Night Fight studios. Andre Bishop's latest win over top contender Kobe Nichols puts him squarely in the heavyweight title picture. After years of dominance by the champion Isaac Frost, we now have a situation where both Bishop brothers are considered legitimate challengers for the title. The surprising news from the offices of promoter D.L. McQueen this week is that the Bishop brothers have signed to fight each other, a heavyweight eliminator that's already being billed as sibling rivalry. The winner will earn the right to face Frost in what could be the biggest championship fight in decades. Yeah, yeah. We welcome you to the MGM Grand here Skip. in Las Vegas for one of the more unique and anticipated heavyweight title eliminators we've ever had. Brother against brother. Biblical in terms. Andre Bishop against his estranged brother Raymond Bishop to see who will move on and fight the heavyweight champion of the world, Isaac Frost. This big baby Ray, man, he ain't so good. Come on. He's got a longer reach than I do. Damn, Jesus. Good flush shot upstairs. Andre Bishop. So I was just thinking about this. There's a sibling rivalry. Because there's me and Big Baby Ray. Me and his brother, Andre's brother. And then there's DL McQueen and his daughter. Uh Megan, I think. Seen both these guys before, and we have a feeling, we just kind of have the feeling that it could be one of those special nights. Yeah, because their styles, it suits up for one of those special nights. Excellent hook by Andre Bishop. Right to the belt line. Up and cut. Let's move. You remember when Andre Bishop was a messing good, him up too. middleweight prospect? He was a great combination puncher. That's what he's doing now as Come a on. heavyweight here. Solid straight right hand. That's a good job by Bishop offensively. Landing his combinations is a key to victory. I think I'm going to call it family business. What's going on, kid? You look like crap out there. Up, okay? He might be a little brother. He's got a big punch. Now he's gonna put you on your ass if you're not careful. 
So let's get it together. Now! I've been Big Baby Bishop ever since you won the gold medal. I never had a chance to be anything else. Never even had a chance to be my own man. I think that's a lie, but okay. Here we go. Round two is underway. Oh, what? I think that's part of the scripting. There is no way he took me out in three hits. Yeah, there's no way. Yeah, see, I knew that was part of the scripting. It was only a matter of time before it actually kicked in. Knock you out, big brother. <laughs> Brian Kenny back here on Friday Night Fights. A shocking turn of events in the battle between the Bishop brothers this past weekend as Raymond knocks out his older brother, Andre. Andre was unable to beat the count after a big right hand from Big Baby in the second round. The stage is now set for a heavyweight showdown between Raymond Bishop and the champion. And now we got to go against Frost. Because now that I knew we had to play Ray at one point. <laughs> GM Grand here in Las Vegas. As the oh, we got to play Frost. Raymond Bishop takes on the ultimate intimidator, the world champion Isaac Frost. Teddy Frost is what he is. Pure power. I want to make Frost lose just because he's a dickhead. All he has to do is look back at some of the fights in the history of this sport. Look back at Liston and Ali. Sonny Liston. Did you see? I pushed him out of the fucking thing. This is why he fucking raped me. But it is part of the game scripting. Like, it's not... I don't think it's possible to beat Frost. Unless you play like a little girl, you know? Because Frost doesn't lose stamina. Because look at this. Like, I can just literally go back and forth well, this is a whole new ball game. and he's not going anywhere it's a bad thing about this game that's why I haven't bought NBA 2K14 is because it's scripted as well and I don't like scripted games. Like, I want to be able to do stuff freely. An ugly situation has developed Ray? here. The paramedics Ray, are up. rushing into the ring. Come on, Ray, get up, man. Please, sir. Please, sir. Bishop is absolutely motionless. Give us some room, people. We need to work. Isaac, do you feel bad about what happened tonight? Do I feel bad? <laughs> no. That's not how this works. This is called boxing. Let me do it. Listen, I'm not gonna cry every time some clown gets hurt, right? Raymond Bishop knew the risks when he stepped into the ring with me. Maybe if he ever wakes up, I'll knock some sense into his stupid ass. Tell Dio he could have whatever he wants. Get me in the ring with Frost. I know emotions are running high right now, but in the heat of battle, people say things, uh, ugly things. That's all for now. Please. Tell Andre Bishop he doesn't have anything I want. Everybody wants this fight to happen. I don't. Candace, uh, could you send Franco to escort my daughter out? Good night, Megan. Good night, DL. And this is where she uh, blackmails him. I think this is hilarious. Good night, Ms. McQueen. Franco, my father's letting you go down for setting up Andre Bishop. I don't know what you're talking about. You will. I'll show myself out.
If I'm going down for the bishop job, you're going with me. You gave the order. What the hell are you talking about? Your daughter just told me that I'm going down for setting up bishop? How does she even know about that? Um, down. She doesn't know anything. Don't fuck with me, McQueen. Nobody can prove anything. It's your word against the next con. We're fine. Until now. Still don't like her sniffing around. Excuse me. I think I forgot my phone. I forgot my phone. <laughs> and it was on record. If I'm going down for the bishop job, you're going with me. I believe Andre Bishop has something you want. Megan, you can't do this. Megan! I'd do it even I'd do it anyway, honestly.